Hey everyone, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Hank Niblock, and I've had the honor of serving as your Student Bar Association President for the last year. And in 2021, we decided to make a new tradition, that being that Wake's SBA President would deliver a message to the graduating class at graduation. And while of course, in the future, this message will be in person, because of our shortened ceremony, our virtual address will have to suffice. Regardless, I'm honored to speak to you in light of such a special occasion. First and foremost, I wanna congratulate all of our students. From our JD students, to our LLM students, to our SJD and MSL students, I share congratulations with you all over this special occasion. I consider myself fortunate to have had the opportunity to have to get to know many of you and to see us all grow and embody Wake's mantra, pro humanitate, meaning for humanity. There's no doubt in my mind that our students, in all programs, and all across the world, will have significant impact in their communities. The adversity faced by the class of 2021 is, and to use an increasingly cliche word, unprecedented. From the original shock of the COVID-19 breakout to spending nearly half of our law school careers virtual, we have experienced law school like never before. Yet our students, our faculty, and our staff rose to the occasion and adapted to the new normal of online learning. And not to mention that COVID didn't stop our students from working within the Winston-Salem community. Our students continue to provide pro bono services to the community, and our student orgs continue to remain involved in fulfilling their missions locally. This is best embodied by Hennis Shaw, the winner of the Smith Anderson Pro Bono Award, a graduating 3L who logged nearly 600 hours of pro bono work despite nearly half of her three years in law school being remote. While COVID has changed our world in permanent ways, the perseverance shown by our students highlights that wherever in the world our graduates may be, they are ready for any challenges. And our students will be all over the world. We are fortunate to have students from Saudi Arabia to China and dozens of other countries throughout the world. We are also fortunate to have students from states all across the United States. And then we have some of us like myself and graduating 3L Jenny Maynard who were born and raised here in Winston-Salem. This diversity has provided us with such a unique opportunity to learn from our colleagues, to create memories and embrace differing cultures. And this diversity also provides us with an opportunity for our students to get connected and have an impact in communities, whether these communities may be local or whether they may be around the world. During law school, it has become evidently clear how quickly and how willing our alumni are to help our students. I know that the class of 2021 will continue this tradition and will look for any ways to help our current students. Our entrance into the workforce begs the question, what makes Wake Forest lawyers different? Three things come to mind, and each of these three qualities leaves our graduates prepared to handle whatever challenges we may face. First, Wake Forest lawyers are team players. When you hear about law school generally, you hear about the competitive nature of law school. That couldn't be further from the truth here at Wake. From day one, it is made clear that Wake Forest lawyers work together and help each other. And I know this message hits home for many of our students. During my first year, my experience would have been completely different had I not had the support network through my fellow students and through our faculty. So in an increasingly connected world, Wake Forest lawyers are ready to be part of the team. Secondly, Wake Forest lawyers care to serve. During numerous social justice movements throughout the last several years, Wake Law students have been not only outspoken, but committed to enacting change and quick to volunteer and help out in any way possible in their communities around the world. Being a lawyer means more than being of service to clients. Being a lawyer means that we serve our communities and our society at large, and Wake Forest lawyers are prepared and ready to stand up and do whatever it takes to serve. Finally, Wake Forest lawyers, but especially the class of 2021, are ready for whatever the world has for us. COVID has required us to adapt to a completely different way of learning and communicating. Our students handled it with grace and did what was required of them. To conclude, I want to again share congratulations with our graduates, wherever you may be. We all know that this year's celebration is less than we would have hoped for, but I am so thankful for my experiences with each of you and having been fortunate enough to learn with you and to learn from you. When first preparing this message, I'd hoped to pose a challenge to our graduates, a challenge to do this or that, or a challenge to have an impact. But I realized that our graduates simply don't need that. Our graduates now have a world-class education paired along with their unique personalities and talents that have been fostered through our time in law school. 
I can say with 100% confidence that nothing, absolutely nothing, will stop our students from having an impact, whether locally or around the world. So instead, I want to gently remind you all to just be yourself. You have all the tools necessary. And in a world that is obsessed with bigger and better, you are enough, and you always will be. I look forward to seeing the incredible things you accomplish over the next several years. Thank you.